from Mainland Regional High School. I'm meteorologist Joe Martucci. It is time for week four, Mike? Four, week correct. In the four. high school football world, week four. Everywhere else it's week five because there's a week zero in right. high school football. So this is week four. Right, I have to do my math better. Right. And you would think I'm a numbers guy. Exactly. Numbers. Anyway, high school football forecast time. Mike, last week, what do we think of the weather? I think it was pretty perfect. Perfect, perfect. As we said last week, you're undefeated this year. You're 4-0. We will see if that holds this weekend. There is more pressure on you now because yes. we are going to leap in the fall That's or maybe true. fall in the fall, fall maybe. The, fall. Yeah, see what you uh, there. the first Friday of fall yes. is this Friday. We got a big game. That's why we're here at Mainland. Mainland 3-1 and one, host Hamilton 4-0. Uh, and oh. Hamilton number 4 in our Elite 11. Yeah, uh, okay. Four is floating around. Mainland number 10 in our Elite 11. So we'll see. Now it's got to get a little, forecasting's got to get a little tougher. Summer, mix and fall. We don't know which way it's yeah. going to go. We'll see if you stay undefeated. Also, you said four cast. There you go. Four. There you go. four for you there. So, um, so we got Hamilton right here at Mainland on Friday night, Mike. Now, I know we've talked in weeks and years past. You're not a wind I'm guy. I'm not a wind guy. No. <sighs> This is going to be tough. I don't know. And we might have a loss column for this week for you, Mike. Well, we'll see. While we are getting, like, real football, crisp, cool weather Friday, it comes at the expense of wind. So All what right. happens to Mike McGarry when it's windy out? You're trying to keep the stats on the clipboard. The papers get blown around. It's it's just difficult to handle. I thought you memorized it all. Uh, no. No, you got to write it down, especially okay. the older you get. I Yes, although you're the one who has more hair than I do. I there you, you go. Got the, you got the full full <laughs> hair. I got a little bit back here. All right, let's talk about our forecast. The good news is it's fairly easy from the standpoint. Everyone's seeing the same thing. Doesn't matter if you're up the shore. Doesn't matter if you're all the way inland in Cumberland County. Temperatures falling from the 60s as we go into the game times here and kickoff on our Friday evening. But that wind is strong. I mean, we're talking about northerly winds, 15 miles an hour sustained. Mm. Um, to give you an idea, we're here in mainland. Hair's blown a little bit. It's about 10 miles an hour sustained, so a little bit windier right. than this. Not super windy. Which but way? Not. Which way is it coming from Friday night? Well, from the north. Okay. So it's coming from, in this, this case, way. this way okay. all the way there. So, so we're kicking off this way. Yeah, yes, yeah. so we're going to be kicking off this yeah, way right. here. Certainly, as we fall into fall, it is feeling like fall. And, and you know what you got to do? Here's the key to handle the forecast you just gave me. Don't get fooled, fans. Don't get sucked in. It's going to be warm, a little warm during the day Friday. Sure. But when that sun sets, yep. that temperature is going to drop. So bring a jacket, bring a sweatshirt, uh, bring a hoodie, bring a pullover, bring something to keep you warm once that sun drops. Well, now I'm thinking, have you seen my Facebook page lately? No, I haven't. Okay, because I'm, I'm currently in a little bit of hot water with the people now because I said 60s is not shorts and t-shirt weather and apparently I'm wrong. I think you are. I think 60s is shorts and t-shirt weather. I think 50s is when you get out of it. So you're telling me on Friday night you're going to be wearing shorts and a t-shirt? No, then? because we're going to be in the 50s once no, the I, game. I said it might just drop into the, it might be 59 well, that's, by the that's end That's good game. enough for me. Okay. I'll tell you what, I'm covering a game Saturday, Buna up at Burlington City. Yeah. If it's the same forecast, I might be in shorts Saturday during the day. Well, on Saturday I can see you being in shorts because our Saturday kickoffs around noon, right? Right, we're talking about correct. Noonish. Uh, temperatures in the upper 60s, there but going go. into the low 70s. Right, right. So I think you've got shorts weather. Tailor made there. right there. Tailor made for you right there. And no rain on Saturday either. So, Mike, that's what we got. Anything else you want to add here for our high school football? Nope, forecast? so far so good. So uh, just keep the rain away. That's the real sign of an L, would okay. be rain. Maybe we'll go 4 0 and 1. Right, there you by go. Next week. There you go. We'll see what happens. All right, for the latest South Jersey weather, you can follow me at AC Press Martucci. You can go to our website, pressofac.com slash weather2. And for Mike, you can follow him at AC. Press McGarry. Pressofac.com slash sports is where you get all the latest scores and analysis from him and our team as we go into Friday and Saturday. Take care, everybody.